uh, Laura Williamson. I teach at Palo Alto Elementary, and I teach third grade. Surprised, of course, um, and I couldn't believe it. I couldn't because, like you said, I, I feel like there are so many good teachers that I thought, me? You sure? And, and to be honest with you, when they gave us the ballot for the nominations and I was on there, I felt silly because I saw my name and I was looking around at everyone like, <laughs> but nobody was paying attention. But, um, you know, and everybody voted. Uh, and when I found out that I won, I was, I was surprised. I was shocked because, I, like you said, there's so many good teachers there. I couldn't believe that I was voted for. Honestly, I've always wanted to be a teacher. I remember since I was uh, my first day of kindergarten, I came home and told mom, I'm going to be a teacher when I grow up. And um, which is funny because growing up, um, I used to like to pretend I was a teacher, and I used to like to pretend that I was running a store. I always played store and teacher. And um, as much as I wanted to teach, you know, went in a different path, and I, I started my own business. And it was great until I had kids, and then I thought, I really want to go back. I want to go back to school and, um, and teach, just go back and do what I wanted to do. And of course, I wanted to come back to South Sam because I feel like, I don't know, the community's great. I grew up here. I wanted to, um, to be part of it. A lot. I do. And that's why I was so surprised that they chose me. Um, but I'm still flattered every day by people who come and tell me. And not only congratulations, but they tell me that it's well-deserved, which makes me feel really good, especially from the teachers that I look up to, or my mentor, um, who was actually nominated also. And she, I think, had a big part of, um, you know, teaching me um, and me learning to be a great teacher. She was, I tell her, my superwoman, because my first year, I thought, oh my gosh, what is this? What am I supposed to do? You know, with paperwork and stuff. And she, she saved me. She helped me. Um, so it's meant a lot to me for them to come and tell me that it was well-deserved. Um, it's hard to t see me other than teaching because I'm so new at it. I really love it. Um, I did think that I wanted to become a counselor eventually because um, I feel like my strength is that I do connect with the kids. I, and I tell my principal that when the kids are in the classroom and they're struggling that I feel like that's me because I grew up in the community and you know my mom was a single mom and it was hard for me you know and so I see them and I feel like I can connect to them I, I, I get it when they're having a hard time in the classroom just thank you to everyone I, I can't believe that they actually voted for me for their teacher of the year and the kids are awesome and they were also as excited for me and they still come and my kids from a couple years ago still fifth graders now and still come tell me Miss Williamson and still hug me and come you know come see me still come into my classroom to come hug me and tell me hi every day so thank you to them because I, I appreciate them they keep me going every day